Alrighty, so let's go ahead and and take a look at our data. And so I had mentioned that you need to filter out and only look at one day at a time. And so I want to show you specifically how to do that. So the first thing to do is to remember that you want to select all of the data. So you scroll all the way to the bottom and sort of the fastest way to do that is to use this handle over here on the side. And then you find that bottom most and rightmost cell and then you do command or control A that selects all of the data and then what I want to do is I want to create a filter view so I click here on filter views I say create new filter view and you'll notice it puts that dark gray around everywhere and then I want to filter out the days and so if I am not sure why that is called plant height. That is weird. I am going to <laughs> change that and call it day. <laughs> okay, so we're going to filter out the days. And we. I want to say we want to create, let's look at just maybe day seven. So I'm going to undo all the, the days except for day seven. And I'm going to say okay. Before I can really do anything with these data, I then need to select them and move them to a new sheet. So let's do that. So again, I'll go to the bottom most, I'll select all, I'll, con I'll, I'll copy it. So that means I will either Command or Control C or I can right click and choose copy. I then will add a new sheet to my spread to my workbook and then I'm just going to paste. Now that I've done that, I have all of the data from just day seven. And then I can rename this sheet to be day seven. Alrighty.